Hello friends subscribe to our channel GDC and press the bell icon for more updates. Hello friends, welcome back, back once again. Today I am going to discuss size of hard gelatin capsules. Since hard gelatin capsules can vary in their sizes on the basis of the water of amount that can be filled or aspirin or bicarbonate that can be filled. These are the standard parameters which have set by the recommending authority. So hard gelatin capsule sizes can be vary from triple zero to five. I will draw here a table, you will easily remember that. So firstly, size of capsule. Size of capsule, then water that can be filled and water that can be filled always to be in the ml while aspirin that can be filled into the hard gelatin capsule that can be took into the milligram. So the size of different capsules are varies from triple zero, double zero. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Here, your triple zero is the largest in size, while fifth number is the smallest. Make sure this is a very important point which capsule size is largest, that is triple zero, while fifth number is the smallest. So in the triple zero, second zero, zero, one, two, three, four, five, all the capsules have different capacity that water can be filled in this. So what happened? I will draw here a table. You will read it. Then I will use sort trick so that you can easily remember that that how much amount can be filled into the each capsules. So in the triple zero, you will remember this. 1.35 1.35 this is the maximum means in the largest 1.35 can be filled while in the smallest I will discuss one by one next in the double zero how much amount will be filled 0 0.95 0 0.95 in the double in the zero 0. 6, 5, 1, 1 number capsules can fill 0 0.50, now in the second, in the second number capsules 0 0.35 can be filled, while in the third number 0 0.30 can be filled, in the fourth number 0. 2, 1 can be filled while in the fifth number 0 0.13 can be filled. So how you will remember these parameters? Not all the important but largest and the smallest are very much important. So simply you will remember 1.3 is the largest while 0.3 is the smallest. You will shift point from here to here. What? 1.35? 0.13 that is easy Next. if you want to remember all the size of capsules then simply 0.4 here next 0.3 next 0 0.15 0 0.15 Next, point zero five, point zero nine, point zero nine. Just four, three, one and a half, one and a half, point zero five, point zero nine, point zero nine. If you want, either simply your important one is this one point three five, largest, smallest, point one three. Now, 
this is the amount of ml if question asked in the form of milligram then aspirin majorly took as the standard so aspirin amount what happened in the largest your amount will be 1000 mg while in the smallest this will be 100 mg so how this sequence can be occurs so i will discuss here 1000 in the triple zero while in the double zero your amount will be 650 650 next in the single zero what happened Now in the one, first number capsule amount will be here 3, it's variable, sometimes 320 or 350, to remember this I will talk here 350. In the second number, your amount will be 250 milligram, in the third number, your amount will be 200 milligram, in the fourth number, your amount will be 150 milligram. So this is the parameter between the each capsule size and their capacity. So, by this table, we can easily remember what happened. How the amount of aspirin can you be remembered? Here, simply we will remember 350 after reduction 1000, 350, then 650, 350, 150, 350, 150, 150, 100, now remove the 50, 50 from each. So this is a simple trick. I hope so, you can remember. But here two points is majorly important. What is the maximum amount that can be filled in the largest number of size capsule? That is 1.35. While in the smallest, 0.13. What is the maximum amount of aspirin that can be filled in the largest capsule size? That is 1000 milligram. While in the smallest, 100 milligram. Thank you.